What is going on ladies and gentlemen, we are back again with another 90 Day Fiance video and this one right here has no more has it been lately It's all about Mike and apparently this man has made a video claiming to be Mike's friend In fact, he claimed he's known Mike since middle school now How did I come across this video? Well, very simple This video was emailed to me if you dig what I'm saying and uh, to be honest with the person that emailed me This is quite a reliable source always emailing me things every odd blue moon and every now and then but it's generally always some really good strong core stuff if you dig what i'm saying so i do trust that this legitimately probably is mike's friend and everything that he does say well to be fair what he what he has to say i'll leave that down to you guys to give your thoughts and your opinion because some things in my opinion add up but some things in my opinion don't add up but nonetheless no let's not waste any more time let's give a big massive shout out to every single person that is a member of the channel and now let's get into this video if you dig what i'm saying so this isn't something that we can't or commonly or commonly talk about i don't talk about this a lot stuff like this but since i know the person um i gotta say this mike Um, this, we, listen, the show was a mistake for you to do, dog, and I'm hoping a lot of the stuff I'm hearing ain't true. Now, however, you're kissing the woman and you're on top of her and farting, that's pretty disgusting, that's pretty immature, but like, going on this show, like, I want to say this, if some of the things, if the things that she's saying are true, let the courts decide that if she went that route. Right now, he's still covered under the non-disclosure agreement. She was released from the show, so she could talk about it. But he's still covered under NDA, so he can't come out and defend himself. So it's almost like beating on a guy who's handcuffed already. All I'm saying is, is this. If you did what she's alleging you did, that's pretty messed up. That's pretty messed up, and I hope it ain't the truth. After, what I will say, though, is after... And I'm not going to put it in the video because I don't want people to make up their minds unless they've seen, who, seen it, which they probably have. After you're, you're no longer bound by the NDA agreement, come out and talk about some of this stuff, bro. Defend yourself because if you don't, it's going to make you look pretty guilty. All I'm saying is, is he doesn't seem like the kind of person to do this, the things that he's being accused of, you know, like what he's being accused of. We'll put it that way. He don't seem like that kind of person. I have known Mike my whole life. I basically grew up with him. Well, from like middle school on. Bad idea to go on the show, bro. Dude, she was a cam girl. And you're over here talking about, if you stop doing this, I'll pay your whole way. Dude, you can't turn a hoe into a housewife, doc. You can't buy her and make her make her loyal. It's not going to happen. You, you can't throw a little bit of money at her and expect her to stop turning around the camera and putting her naked body out there for everybody to see while she's while she has kids and everything bro if her having kids didn't change her online behavior you paying for her ain't gonna change her online behavior i hope you didn't do what she's saying you did but all that aside giving her more money 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 doesn't change who you are money just puts a magnifying glass on who you already are and makes it worse just saying bro i hope this ain't true this show, I know you, and I don't think it's true, but if there's evidence out there, bro, you better come out and defend yourself. Some of the things I'm hearing, not like, not quite jiving with who I know you to be, so I hope it's not true. I really, really hope it's not true. Later. I forgot. That's where it ended. My bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. <laughs> anyway, 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 anyway. So here's the thing. I'm not too sure. He talked about court cases, talked about allegations, and he needs to defend himself. Now, I'm not too sure about any court case. I'm not too sure about any allegations. The only thing that, but what I am definitely sure about is what we have seen on the screen. And what we've seen is that Mike 100% tried to buy a woman. 
Simple as that. Plain, point blank period. Now, that is something that I'm definitely, definitely sure about because we've seen it. So the other part, to be honest with you, I will do my best to try and investigate exactly what he's referencing to in terms of this court case allegation because, again, I've heard nothing about that at this moment in time. And if I can find something, of course, I'm going to be able to let you guys know. But if somebody already does know, then please do let us know in the comment section or maybe just DM me, you know what I mean? And then obviously I can make a whole video about it, giving you my uh, actual opinion on, you know, the allegations that he he is re referring to that I don't know about. But at the same time, though, he also talks about how he knows Mike. Mike's my friend. Um, you know, we've been friends in middle school and this isn't just what he would do. Well, brother, guess what? It seems to me as if you don't know Mike. Because to be honest with you, you could be friends with a lot of people for a very long time. But it doesn't mean they're always going to share every single thing about themselves to you. And sometimes you can be friends with someone for a very long time. But it doesn't mean you're always going to know each other things about them if you're too busy focusing on yourself and your own life. If you dig what I'm saying, which is what we are supposed to say. So really and truly, you know, I wouldn't. I'm not going to see and be like, how dare you not notice that Mike did this, Mike did that. Because to be honest with you, that does happen. Do you know what I mean? That does happen. That is just the way life works sometimes, okay? But at the end of the day, though, I understand he's surprised, he's shocked. But buddy, my friend, <laughs> to be honest with you, based on how Mike has been behaving on social media alone has of late, he has made himself become even more and more guilty as time has gone by. So to be honest, would I advise Mike to speak up for himself once his contract is over and he actually is able to do it? Um, probably not because Mike doesn't really know how to do that unless he got someone else to speak for him. But also on top of that, he did speak about how him and is now out of a contract, which therefore does counter the fact that there's a rumor at this moment in time. I only say rumor because I don't know if it's confirmed, but there is a rumor right now that Hemina is currently actually filming for another season of Night of the with her new partner, the Canadian guy. So if she's out of contract, then that means she can't be filming a new season. But if she is in contract, you, you, you see what I'm saying? So there are a few bits here and I'm like, mm, 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 mm. but nonetheless, though, the guy didn't really say too much, to be honest. I feel like he held back quite a bit. He just kind of wanted just to speak about Mike just like here and there. But for the intuitive, he answered nothing. You know what I'm saying? Kind of pointless of a video, isn't it now? But anyway, it was important for me, to, for me to show you. It was important for me to show you guys, obviously, what's happening anyway, because you guys might hear something or heard something that he said that you may think, oh, shit. That actually makes sense to this part on this episode at this minute at this moment when Mike did this and him and it did that. It might make sense to this post and that post. Hey man, you never know, man. We are all detectives on our own right, if you dig what I'm saying. But most importantly, though, if you know anything about any allegations and any kind of court thing happening right now, please do definitely let me know via DMs or even in the comment section. But if you don't know, that's fine. I will do what I can to find out if I can find out. Otherwise, if I can't find that, then I'm going to assume that this guy is talking absolute cack, if you dig what I'm saying. Anyway, thank you so much for your time. As always, lovely, you lovely, lovely people. I will catch you guys in the comment section. Has always. Thank you so much. We are done and we are out. Peace.